everybody, it's Mrs. Goodyear here and welcome to Phonics Today. Now I'm going to talk to you about a very special sound in a minute, but before we do that, let's have a look at the four good listening rules and see if you can remember them. Good listening is staying quiet. Good listening is sitting still. Good listening is looking at the person who is talking. And good listening is listening to all the words. And if you remembered all of those four good listening rules, then a massive well done to you. Right, let's think about the sound that we're going to learn today. Here it is. It's this sound. I wonder if you can make that sound. Try with me. Well done. Now, do you notice that when we make that sound, our teeth come close together our tongue is just behind our teeth and our lips are a little bit open. Well done. Now I know a song all about the s sound and it goes a bit like this. I'm going to use my hands to make a snake. Ready? The snake is in the grass. The snake is in the grass. The snake is in the grass. Why don't you try with me? Are you ready? Here we go. The snake is in the grass. The snake is in the grass. The snake is in the grass. Well done. And we sing about the snake in the grass. Because snake starts with a s sound. Okay, we're going to think about trying to write the s sound. So for this, you're going to need some coloured pens or crayons or pencils and a little bit of paper. So if you want to pause the video and grab what you need, I'll see you in a minute. Hi everybody, welcome back. I hope you've got all that you need. I've got some coloured pens with me today. I've got a blue one, a black one, a green one and a red one and I'm going to use them when I write my sound s. so I'm going to use my writing slate and first of all my black pen now when I hold my pen it's really important that I use my tripod grip and for that I need three fingers I need my thumb my next finger along and then my middle finger so these three fingers are going to hold my pen right at the very end so that I've got lots of control over it. I'm going to see if I can write my s sound in one movement without taking my pen off the slate at all. Let's see if I can. My turn first and then you can have a go. I'm going to start there and I go round a bit like a snake in the grass. There. That's my s sound. I'm going to try one more and then it'll be your turn. Why don't you have a go now on your paper? You can choose whatever colour pen you want to, to use. Have a go at writing this sound. I'm going to use another colour to see if I can write some more s sounds. Why don't you keep saying the sound while you're writing. I'm going to try and draw a small Well then I hope yours is looking as colourful as mine. Fantastic. Well, you can spend as long as you want to uh, writing your s sounds. I hope that you've had fun 
and keep going with it. Keep practicing as much as you can. That's it for now. I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.